right, welcome to another episode of Black Smart Cafe's Business Lounge. My co-host today is Joshua. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I heart drop Joshua. <laughs> He's on the social dating apps. <laughs> we'll post it down here. <laughs> okay, and we have very special guests today. We'll let them introduce themselves mm. and their businesses as well. Yes. Hello everyone, my name is Odwin and I'm one of the directors of Taxmark Cafe in AC. I'm Jen, and I'm also one of the directors of Taxmark Cafe KC and also an owner, the owner of Puppy Scratchy. Wow. <laughs> and what's our photo booth? <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, and me too. <laughs> and and roster photo booth. And my name is Brazil, one of the directors of Taxman Cafe KC. And I'm A, so one of the directors of Taxman KC, and we're also partly an investor. Yeah. And also oh, investors. investors. <laughs> 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 They're very busy. <laughs> business that we forgot to mention. Oh, and also our very new baby, <laughs> uh, we are Ant. Ant. So that, that's, that's a project. <laughs> that's Ant. Amplified Marketing and Agency. That's right. Project. So we project. help um, we help businesses who wants to have social media presence Correct. Um, or who wants to have their um, business set up in terms of, um, you know, the, the Shopify or or in Google, or in Facebook, or in Instagram. So it's really just helping them to market their business. And also so, if they want events, um, yeah. we can set it up for them. Yes. Um, mm -hmm. Photo booth, or they want background. So if they want MC. a host for MC. <laughs> <laughs> all in one. All you in can one. do everything. <laughs> one-stop shop for your business. Yeah. Yeah. And also yes. merchandise. So we yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You can tell from our shirts. Right? Yes. <laughs> 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 These are from <laughs> so digital marketing, um, social media platform management, and uh, and anything in between that. <laughs> yes. All right. Well done. Okay, so what inspired you guys to build um, the businesses that you are working on right now, and then the future um, um, projects that you are um, planning for yeah. the future? <laughs> So what inspired us is because of the people behind us, right, as well. Um, yeah. Um, I think the values of helping other entrepreneurs, individuals who are running their business. Yeah. And um, like we always say this, we want to help you um, reach your goals through tracks, um, accounting services, um, and much more. Like, you know, we, we also do... Um, Consultancy, mm -hmm. and if you go further, yes. Yeah. So what inspires us is the you know the values or of doing that, yeah. and as also because we we love our job, right? But yes. we, we think we think um like we what we always say we don't put your eggs in one like thing. You don't put egg in one basket. Yeah. So, yeah. so so just the, just the background. So. Jen and I are nurses, full-time yeah. full -time oh, nurses, and I'm an IT, hospitality. So we're all, um, we're all working, working full-time yeah. in a different field, field. field. Yeah. and um, at the same time we're also full-time directors of Tax Market Cafe, which is an accounting, yeah. Um, yeah. accounting yeah. firm. Yeah. And, and you can say like you know, we, we use our talents and <laughs> Not just that, like our strengths to tax, to tax smart, to tax smart Casey. I mean, we we pour on our hearts, and uh, um, the way it goes is you not know, the profit is the secondary for us at the moment. Um, I think that's what drives us. It's working as a team and the values very much. Just believing in what you do, and we believe that we can make a difference in joining this wonderful team. Yes. Great. Okay. Oh. <laughs> what I'm hearing, so you are directors of Taxmark Cafe KC, which is an accounting firm mm -hmm. in southeast of Melbourne, right? But none of you are accountants. Mm -hmm. So, correct, right? Yes. Yes. Right. yes. Um, <laughs> some of our viewers might be in a field or industry that's different from their dream business. Inspire those who actually have a dream. I want to do this business, but <laughs> I don't have experience. I don't have knowledge. It's not my field. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. talk with them. <laughs> well, 
you know, you can do it as long as you have professionals behind you helping you establish your business. Make sure that the business that you're going into already have you know, set of processes. Yeah. Like when we enter Tax Mart, our lovely joy, <laughs> where yes. we have like you know processes everything in place. In place. <laughs> so yeah, she, she she will just train us, and of course we, we hire you know our accountant Dave. Yeah. Um, and it's very important that we share similar values yeah. and. Um, yeah, and that really worked well. So, yeah, in, in terms of that, yeah, just have professionals behind you and just trust that you can do it. If you don't know what you're doing, ask the professionals and yeah. And I guess um, just don't be afraid to jump in because sometimes there are times where you don't have to be hundred percent sure for you to be for you to jump in. There are a lot of times you make decisions in life wherein you just have to. You ha just have to know some things and then, you know, yeah. know what are the exit strategies if it doesn't work. Yep. And then be a sponge, be a learner. I think that's one really mm -hmm. big thing for us. We yeah. just, in a span of a few weeks, <laughs> <laughs> we just tried to learn everything and uh, while we're doing our full-time mm -hmm. job. So, and again, it's teamwork. Yeah. Yeah. So you just sacrifice. You can do it. <laughs> <laughs> And, so, and I guess when an opportunity presents itself, just grab it and just learn correct. it later. Yeah, yeah. I also want to add some points, a couple points. So, not everyone can pursue their career through the field of their choice. Yeah. Yeah. Some of us may be, you know, in the nursing or whatever, but you have other passions. Right. And other strengths. Other uh, strengths, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, let's face it, like, you know, we. We're also looking for opportunities, and this is one way we can do it without leaving our jobs. Um, so uh, you have to find that, you find it in yourself. And I always think about this. So not all CEOs are special in their craft. Like Quanta's CEO, it's not a pilot. Um, uh, I can think of you know few few companies like. Uh, that companies, they're not not all of the, the management executive levels are IT geeks. Yeah. 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 So I, I think it's always it always um, be what what you're passionate in and then what what teach. Yeah. So yeah. I'm just gonna add to that. To me, it's very simple. When you wake up in the morning and you want to do what you're doing and you keep on going, that means you love what you do yeah. and you can. Yeah. Yeah. Doesn't matter if. You know, not <laughs> like in like specializing in that field, but if you love doing it, go for it. Great, that's very good. Thank you. <laughs> so another question for um at the first level. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Is, um, for like the new um, entrepreneurs, or let's say aspiring entrepreneurs, um, what points can you give them? Let's say even though they want to get the best story, yeah. Um, what can you like? Um, again, uh, I think it's it's not gonna be overnight. So you, you have to find. I think the key is always look for opportunities. So when we heard about tax mark, we know already them since the start, like January last year. We've been engaged with them. And then way we are presented, two things we know already what this kind of business. So you're not gonna buy something you don't believe. Yeah. So if you're if you're looking for something and you wanna be an investor or something, you have to do some research, but also to be passionate about it. I think that's the main thing. The main idea is you have to be aligned with your values with what you're doing. So I, I think for me, I like socially, and then I'm also good. I'm not good. Uh, I like handling finances, so that takes boxes. So, and yeah, it's not no brainer for me. I started with that. And, and I guess for me, um, is just don't be afraid and continue to learn, continue to grow. Yeah. There's always opportunities there. Mm -hmm. and for Jen and for other um, that you said, I mean, how like multiple businesses that you're working from, mm -hmm. and then you're working for each other. Um, what is like the mistakes that you can like uh, tell us? Um, uh, Just few hands. <laughs> what did you say? No, 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 no. Just working double time. <laughs> um, you go. <laughs> what kind of mistakes? Um, well, first of all. 
one mistake you can you can do is just not believing in yourself and secondly not trying and not getting the, the support from the right people mm. like for example oh i, I want to do this but i'll just consult the internet dr google <laughs> <laughs> but actually on the contrary there are experts and there are like right. separate fields who can actually give you the right advice mm. on the right path yeah. mm. in in life if you want to do things correctly and do things properly there's always the right way and the wrong way too sensitive <laughs> so I'm sensitive with negative feedbacks when when I first started the roster photo with business so I really want to I think personally I'm a, I'm a people pleaser so if you know if I get a negative feedback from one of my clients that causes me anxiety yeah. um, but now you know I, I learned to realize you know that it's probably not about me it's probably the other person some they have some issues of their own it's not really about their product if we're not getting that those feedbacks from other clients anyway mm -hmm. and and to take that on board if there's really something wrong with yeah. you know with the business then we have to do something about it to reverse it yeah. yeah and not to be mad at you if I'm anxious <laughs> <laughs> always pressure your part that's another <laughs> that's another, <laughs> that's another <laughs> <one>. <laughs> yeah. happy wife happy life <laughs> possible to start a business even if it's in a field that you don't have experience or you're not not in right now as long as it's something you believe in you're passionate you're happy yes. right? yeah. Yeah. so there are lots of challenges or mistakes that you can do in your business but it doesn't, it doesn't mean you should end your business there right Just continue pursue it the fight fight those challenges yeah. and lots what, of learning um and start your business like believe in yeah. yourself and yeah. i guess the only way for you to have a business is for you to start it. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so invite them, invite Great. the viewers to upcoming activities. Yeah. So, <laughs> so in here in this beautiful place, Banjo Place, on November 19th from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m., we have the Pinoy Entrepreneurs Small Business Expo 2022. So it's free entry for everyone. We have 36 merchants that's going to be there that includes have different types of services, <laughs> financial, there's food, there's um, clothing, so pretty much everything to showcase our Pinoy businesses and talents. So that's from 10 to 4 p.m. and we'll have a special guest. Yeah, we have some activities and a session there and we have a live entertainment like live music all throughout the afternoon. And best thing is you can mingle with like-minded business people. Yeah. And again, free entry, free parking, so you can park at the uh, Westfield <laughs> down there, or if, if there's just spot <laughs> front, or near the pool. Early, yeah. Yeah. Near the pool, it's um, unlimited parking. Yeah. Um, yeah, and we have the um, uh, Spice Up Mirror yeah, Business yeah. event from 10 a.m. to 11:30 at. Upstairs. <laughs> <laughs> still a bunch of yes, still so a bunch of things. Also, non business people can come. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Definitely. Oh, support. Yeah. Yeah, support our local Pinoy. Uh -huh. yeah. And learn from them. Yeah. Be inspired. Be inspired. Thank you, Miss Valenzuela. <laughs> <laughs> so, where else can our viewers find Tax uh, Mercati Casey? Sorry, you can um, get some information. We also do podcasts and uh, we have a YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. Which is? Taxmart Cafe Taste. Like, like and subscribe. <laughs> We're also on Facebook at Taxmart Cafe Taste. And Instagram. And podcast. <laughs> Spotify. Apple. <laughs> Amazon. And Google. <laughs> yeah. okay. Thank you, guys, Thanks, everyone. Josh. Thank you, Thanks, Josh. Thanks, Josh. Thanks, Josh. Thank you, Josh. Yeah. Don't forget to meet everyone. Don't forget Social to hit them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> thank, thank you for tuning in. These guys are doing good. Josh, yeah. as we always say, as a business owner, entrepreneur, you are not alone. You are awesome. Yeah. 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 Thank you. 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 Yeah.